So you said earlier uh, that Israel has a right to attack Hezbollah as a terrorist organization. I wanted to see, ask if you had seen the Israeli Prime Minister's uh, video that he put out in English to the people of Lebanon last night. He had a couple lines in there. He said, You have an opportunity to save Lebanon before it falls into the abyss of a long war that will lead to destruction and suffering like we see in Gaza. I say to you, the people of Lebanon, Free your country from Hezbollah so that this war can end. That seems like a blanket threat against the civilian population. Is that terrorism? So, first of all, let me say we cannot and must not see uh, the situation in Lebanon turn into anything like the situation in Gaza. Uh, that would, of course, not be acceptable. Um, and ultimately, it is the, as I said in response to an earlier question, it is up to the Lebanese people, not anybody else, to decide on who their government is. As I said in response to an earlier question, no country in the region should dictate to the Lebanese people who their leaders are. Um, not Israel, not, in, not the United States, not any of the other countries in the region, and that should continue but to, Israel is to, dictating to be the case. No, they're, they're conducting uh, operations going after a terrorist organization. That's a different thing than uh, dictating what the civilian government should be. That's a question for the Lebanese people to decide. So, But if they decide against Israel's wishes, Israel is threatening Gaza-like annihilation of the people of Lebanon. And I'm making very clear that um, there should be no kind of military action in Lebanon that looks anything like Gaza and leaves a result anything like Gaza.